Hey everyone, so today I wanted to talk about what the average week looked like for me on the Barbary six month extended course. So as a little bit of background, I wasn't educated in the US. I received my law degree in the UK at the University of Bristol and it was a three year on campus degree. This meant that when I was going into the course, I didn't have any foundation in US law. So that meant that I really needed the extra time to learn everything. I just sat the bar exam in February and I prepared with the six month extended course. The course requires about 10 to 15 hours per week of work, which was great for me because it's also super flexible. And since I was doing a master's at the same time, and also I was working, that meant that it was easier for me to get what I needed done. Because it's 10 to 15 hours per week rather than a certain amount per day, that meant that I could fit my weeks around what I knew was happening. That was really great for me because that meant that I could plan ahead. So every Sunday I would look ahead at my week and say, okay, on Tuesday I have six hours of class, so I'm not gonna study that day. So I'll do an extra couple of hours on Wednesday. And that means that you can just be flexible with yourself too, with your own schedule. The extended course is great if you're working part-time or if you're going to school, or if you just have other commitments and you can't commit to a, just a couple of weeks full-time. The typical schedule for me was about two hours per day at least, and then that meant that some days I could skip it if I wasn't able to commit to the time, and then I would catch up on another day. As I got closer to the day of the actual bar, I decided to take more time and focus, and uh, there were a few weeks where I wasn't able to do anything because I had my master's going on. And because of the way that the course is done, you're able to catch up when you need to, and also using the technology on the personal study plan, it'll tell you what's to, what to prioritize and what to put ahead when you're studying.